Enable screen reader, press square button. No. Um. This guy is set up. That's fine, that's fine. Bird controls off. Pre button taps. Yes. Assist. Oh. Yeah, no, I'd rather know when I'm going to do that or not. Auto pickup. I think I'll just take the essentials. Or economy. Where's it? Where's economy? Well, I guess. That's not there. Um, accessibility. Text. Get that. Mm. Or we'll do that. Okay. Motor ability. Eh. Now that one's good. The blow pads are visible. I do not understand. Oh. Um. Supposed to see the wolf? Because I can barely see that wolf, but I don't see the wolf on the other side. Huh. I'll put it to 80. Yeah, I'll put it to 80. Audio calibration. Yeah, we'll put it on balance. Yep. Okay. Just making sure that was recording. And I was all from PlayStation. And it's from the Santa Monica. Woo! I'll just start the episode here. Hello, everybody, and welcome to God of War Ragnarok. Recap. Now you do recap. Mm. Okay. Uh, if. If it's not interesting, I'll cut here and, and uh, I'll go to the new game and be like, man, it's just everything. Oh, let's, let's check out the recap. Roy's mother is dead. She wanted us to spread her ashes on the highest peak in all the realms. The gods of these realms don't take kindly to outsiders, trust me. You are God. Leader of the Vanir, once yes, but no longer. There's only one person alive who can get you where you need to go. 
First, you need to cut off my head. Odin's eye is on you, brother. Especially now that you've taken to killing his kin. When I came to these shores, I chose to live as a man. But the truth is, I was born a god, and so were you. We can do whatever we want. There are consequences to killing a god! Mother. Back off, Kratos. This has nothing to do. No, 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 my boy! My dear sweet boy! It's Muller. Look, she was a giant. I'm a giant. I guess there's just one thing I don't understand. The giants called me... Loki? Question for another day. Okay. Settings. I need to do this right now. Global volume. Put that at six and put the music at a five. That should be good. There's a lot of that, but eh, it'll be fine. Huh, that was a really quick summary. Eh. <coughs> well, let's get started. Uh oh. Give me a story for, exper for people who want to experience story. Give me Grace, who wants to focus on combat. Balance for that. No mercy. Give me God of War. Give me God of War is for those who want the game as difficult as possible, requiring godlike reflexes and strategy. Okay. We'll just get balance. Give me balance. Hungry? What? What's next? Oh. Storm is getting worse. I'll get them ready. Did he fucking grow up? <coughs> I have 
didn't jam, it's my axe. When did this happen? I thought I would start with nothing. <laughs> of course, it's the horses, we'd have wolves. Our new mode. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> Chunky wolves be like, whoa. I hope Fenrir got some sleep. Maybe he'll be ready to eat when we get home. He is quite sick, Atreus. I know, but he was a little better yesterday. Fenrir. Until he wasn't. If he keeps eating, I'm not giving up on him. Hear that? Yes. Is it hurt? It is her. Oh. State is not far. Get ready. Falcon. Is it her again? It is. Okay. She wouldn't give up that easy, would she? She never does. Stay alert. Oh, I can't get her. Oh. Got you. Oh, my rug, no. I'm trying. Up there, what she? Look out! The trees, they're coming down. That was too close. He's coming around again. God. I do not wish to fight you. I'm losing my grip here. Hold tight. Protection stave is near. Hey, is oh, no. clear shot? Freya, we're not your enemy! Uh, Freya, what? Uh, oh, man. Uh, she is an angry girl. Uh, please don't make me do this! Dave, we made it. Let us go home. It's Becky, Vana, up.
I'm sorry I couldn't take the shot. I did not wish you to. I keep hoping she'll let it go. You saved her life. I killed her son. There is no letting that go. Yeah. Oh. Well, I guess killing Balder really did bring on Fimblewinter. Never stopped snowing after that day. Think it's ever gonna get better? Someday. But the worst is still ahead of us. We must be strong. Those wolves are good boys. They didn't even panic once. <laughs> they're they're used to. I got it. As long as Estreus doesn't appear, then we're all good. I don't hear him. He always says hello. Atreus. Fenrir. You okay, boy? Oh, no. It's okay, boy. You're okay. I know. I missed you too. Where's your food? Still hungry? Come on, boy. You need to eat. Eat. Why? Too big? still eating. He wants to live. He is dying. You're a good boy. A brave boy. Fuck already? Fast and strong. But you can rest now. Okay? I'll be okay. You can let go now. You have to let go. Sofna. Afra. Desu. He's already off strong with the feels, huh? Come. 
be trained. What? No. It's the middle of the night. Night does not stop our enemies. Why? What for? Training is all we ever do, ever. It's not enough. We can't hide forever. We do not hide. We prepare for a fight for which we are not ready. Or go. Time is running out. The prophecies say Fimblewinter leads to Ragnarok. War is coming. Whatever Loki's supposed to be doing, he's supposed to be doing it now. My story doesn't end hiding in these woods. I should be out there, finding out who I am, who Loki is. I will not allow you to pick a fight with gods. I don't want to fight anyone. I just want answers. And if those answers lead to war with Asgard? Well, maybe that's what Mother wanted. We do not know what Mother wanted. Looks like we never will. Look. Can I have a moment alone with Fenrir before I bury him? Recognize that dour expression anywhere. <coughs> Care to tell me what went wrong? The wolf is gone. Oh, no. Not Fenrir. How's the lad taking it? Not well. He goes to bury him. Oh, damn it. All right, brother. Good night, then. covers I'm not questioning armor cuz he's Spartan What the fuck Kratos? What the hell? Are you joining me? Now we've gone crazy. Are you ready? Huh. You walk as though Emir himself sits atop your shoulders. This is your hunt. I will follow. Very well, Grumpus.
fresh kill. At least it didn't suffer. Hmm. Am I to decipher your grunting? Hmm. Tell me your thoughts. We hunt the predator. A wolf. Yes. Predators kill. It is the natural order of things. Your words are misguided. Approach slowly. It's okay, little one. We want to help. Don't we? It depends. No, no, don't! Oh, come on. The sick wolf we found beyond our stave. He found his way inside. As I said he would. We should have acted. It was not our concern. Now it is. Problem doesn't have to reach our doorstep for it to be our responsibility. If we have the power to limit the harm it could cause, we should act. Who are we to hide and do nothing? We are not hiding. Gonna make me pick that one up? Damn. Hmm. Good boy. <laughs> yep, just like this way. Very. Atreus. Hence my bellowing. He never came back from burying the wolf. It's been some time. He cannot be far. We're not bringing the chains? Let's see. Track Atreus. Okay. Ooh, I like the... What is it called? The UI? Hmm. <coughs> A journey she planned when neither of us were ready. Dream of hers. Some other times. Our duty now lies on our son. Oh, it's from Atreus. Or not Atreus. Uh, Kratos. My duty now lies. <laughs> I can't do that. I'll just speak normally. My duty now lies solely on our son, but I still have so many questions for her. So much that I still don't understand. I see glimmers in her and Atreus, and they make me laugh. And they make me smile. But I am left the same questions I have as I try to guide him along his path. He has spoken on who, on who you will become. And while it would become difficult and well. And while it becomes difficult to keep him close, I'm grateful I can continue this journey with him for now. Okay, so we're going on a journey. <clears throat> the wolf Fenrir has been, has been in decline for some time now. Atreus cares for the animal deeply and has not been able to accept that he is dying. In the past, I would have told him to close his heart to this loss, but he's already endured so much. I see the compassion in his heart, and I'm proud of the man he was growing into. 
But I must keep him focused if he's to be ready for the darker days ahead. Not long ago, we rescued a pack of wolves from the raiders of the Lick of Nine. Despite my warnings, a trace decided to name them. Having these two pull the, sl uh, the sled makes transport transportation significantly easier. And Mimir has lived with us since the return of Jotunheim. I've known few I would call friend, and brother fewer still. I've come to rely on the wisdom and counsel of the smartest man alive. Also, he is a he is compact and he does not consume precious resources. Uh, I'm assuming Freya is here. Freya it continues to pursue us, seeking revenge on the death of her son, Balder. I do not wish to fight her. She was a friend, but I will defend myself if she forces my hand. I do not see a peaceful res uh, resolution for our situation. <clears throat> Balder. I do not regret Balder's death. Had I allowed him to kill Freya, he would not have abandoned he would not have abandoned his pursuit. His fate would have been the same. I do not expect Freya to accept what would what happened as necessary. She's likely pursuing she will likely pursue us until one of us is dead. <coughs> Maggie and Modi. The sons of Thor also pursued, a, pursued us on our journey. Maggie was strong but arrogant until his last breath. Modi proved himself a coward, but I pitied him in his last moments. There seemed to be little forgiveness among the Aesir gods, and I expect that we have yet to suffer the consequences of the blood we have spilled. Cool. Lessons, okay. <coughs> oh boy. Oh hey. There's a gate here, so and that's where we need to go. Technique and range. Hmm. Armor. Okay, and weapons. Forged by the Hoodle Brothers. Hmm. So there's no thing. Oh, we could just make a better. We could get a better shield. Hell yeah. Oh wait, hold on. Oh that. So this is the menu. Also oh, up there, there, so they reduced everything, or not reduced, they increased everything and reduced some things. <laughs> and I like how the HP is like a, like certain uh, D and D, or is it Pathfinder? Oh, um. Stats help. Okay. Um, doesn't seem to change anything. Alright. That's cool. Um. Where do I. Alright, there we go. Okay, that's Let's see. Tracks heading down to the frozen river. That's most likely where he did the burying. Frozen river be over here. He crawled through here. You seem troubled in your sleep, even for you. Nightmares? I dream of the past. Almost every night. Ah, the bad old days in Greece? No. It feels like Faye is trying to tell me something. You don't mean to say you're talking to ghosts again, brother? No. But it is something more than memory. You know, hold on. I'm going to check this. The controls real quick. View controls. Oh. Okay. Very 
hand, secondary weapon, primary weapon, arrow type, okay. Everything so far is so understandable. O is to interact. X is to invade. Square is Atreus. Can I switch the controllers? Fantastic. Classic. Yes, there we go. Much better. There we go. Much better. Okay, so you can't just... Use your words, brother. The tracks stop here. And we're not alone. Okay, Raider. Let's read that real quick. Few humans are left in the wild woods these days. Those who survive have either stashed themselves away in the warmest places they can find, or, should they choose not to hide, have only fended off the cold by transmorphifying their filet. <coughs> their guardian spirit. This part of their soul takes the traits of an animal, allowing them to adapt to Midgar's unforgiving climate. As of late, the various remaining uh, raiders around the wild woods seem hell-bent on murdering the lot of us. The protection stave keeps the interlopers at bay, but every hunting trip beyond its borders inevitably results in the encounter of a scouting party or two. Okay. <laughs> Raider on the left. should check on the protection stave. There's a tree up ahead, yeah? Uh. Well? You were right. The stave is broken. Explains our trespassers. What happened here? Between the savage beasts and marauding raiders, he may have sought shelter. Follow the trail. We'll find him. Where's the protection tree? Was it that? on the other side of that gap, if you can clear the way. <laughs> Any idea what could have made the lad wander off? We argued. He accuses me of hiding from Odin. Eh, only sensible to keep a low profile after killing three of his kin. 
A reckoning will come. That is why Atreus must learn to survive on his own. Oh, this is about that prophecy. Just because the giants had you dead on some wall full of otherwise accurate predictions. I do not believe in prophecies. Well, good. <laughs> That's a lot of blood, brother. We must find him. It's not Atreus. It's over here. Oh. The thing. <laughs> I'm skeptical by nature, though we have seen things that defy explanation. So, speaking as the smartest man alive, I have no bloody idea. All right, well, uh, I'm gonna end the episode here. Thank you all so much for watching. If you liked the video, like the video. If you didn't like the video, then don't like the video. I should probably stop doing these. I'll put a little caption down below. Be like, like the video. Don't like it. Comment. Uh, put it in the top left, or right. Yeah, I'll do that next time. All right. Anyways, I'll just do that for now on.